in this video we will create the pen assembly structure in the structure manager application so for see this uh, we have decided this uh, pen assembly structure so pen assembly is our main assembly and inside three sub assemblies body assembly cap assembly and refill assembly and they have the 333 child parts so first we create one uh, item for this pen assembly and then three uh, item for this sub assemblies body cap and refill so what we will do we will create one separate folder so we need to select on home then file new and the folder next here pen assembly structure finish then close this then uh, we select this folder and then file new item next assign assign here pen assembly finish So see here this item uh, item revision get created for pen assembly. So similarly we will create a body assembly, cap assembly and refill assembly. So we need to go file new item next. So one thing uh, here shortcut we don't need to assign again 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 this id and revision okay we you can directly put here name. body assembly finish then cap cap assembly finish and here is refill refill assembly now uh, we need to open this item or item revision we created here in a my team center we need to open it in a structure manager so there are two ways to open it a standard process is always try to open or always try to send item revision in a structure manager okay we can send this item but this is not a standard procedure so always try to send item revision in structure manager so we need to click this item revision and right click on that and then send to here structure manager okay this is structure manager user interface and here we have send our pen assembly item revision second method is uh, we can directly drag and drop and send our item revision to the structure manager okay before this we need to clear this structure manager interface so for that here is one option create new empty window by clicking this it get empty so again we need to go structure manager and we need to do only drag and drop so in this way we can also send whatever the item revision we created in the structure manager application now to create the pen assembly structure okay the creation of structure means we need to create this main assembly then three sub assembly and inside we need to create the our child parts okay this creation and saving of this structure by using this button it is called structure of this pen assembly So here again one thing you need to observe here no bomb view created here still there is a no bomb view okay so when we add these three sub assemblies inside the pen assembly here bomb view get created okay I will show you how 
is get created so for this we need to keep these three numbers 86 87 and 88 so to add this sub assembly item revision in our main pen assembly item revision there are the four methods first is copy paste second is quick add then create item in structure manager and add dot dot by using three options we can create the structure in a structure manager so first we will do uh, quick add okay for that we need to put the number so we know that 86 is for the body assembly so 4 times 0 1 2 3 4 then 86 and here you click on this plus button see this body assembly get created inside the pen assembly here is a view when you go in a team center see this bomb you get created okay it is not get created for this because it is single item revision okay it bomb you get created inside the main assembly okay see here this is body assembly when we add it has three child parts now so when we add this three child parts in a structure manager inside this body assembly item revision so similarly for this three part bomb revision view or bomb view also get created here okay then second method is uh, this copy paste so we know that we need to select this see here uh, we can remove this and uh, we do copy paste we copy this 87 go to structure manager okay suppose accidentally you select this and uh, from here you paste so this cap assembly get created accidentally here inside the body assembly but it need to get created in a pen assembly so for that you don't need to do cut and delete okay simply we need to remove this again we need to select this pen assembly and again paste so it get created here inside the pen assembly then third is add dot dot so for this we need to select this and here uh, we know that 88 is the item id 40 and 88 is the item id for refill so edit and here add dot dot for this uh, we need to click on open object by name and here we need to put 4 times 0 1 2 3 4 8 8 find we need to double click on that here are the revisions so from here you can select the latest revision and simply click on ok so in this way uh, we have created pen assembly this is our main assembly and inside the three sub assemblies by using this we can save this structure now see here our structure inside body assembly there are the three parts tip front tube and rear tube so to create this we need to select this body assembly and as our regular process we can go in a file then new then item next as you as i i have already told you uh, every time you don't need to select assign assign you can directly put here tip finish then front tube rear tube finish 
see this all three parts get created inside the body assembly similarly we can create for this cap assembly so here uh, cap assembly has the three parts cap clip and band so we don't need to go in a structure manager or uh, we need to create separately this item item revisions and then after uh, we need to do copy paste okay we don't need to do this we can directly create here so file new item next so in cap assembly first is the cap clip and band finish close you can save this structure from here okay you can create uh, okay you can add child pass child part in refill assembly or any this assembly separately okay you can suppose clear this bomb view and go in a my team center and here you select this 88 item revision and uh, send to the structure manager see here the refill assembly has refill twist mechanism and nib so you can go here new item finish oh next refill then you can close this and you save, save this structure so you can clear this and again you go to the my team center and here you from here 85 okay by clicking this you can directly open bomb you item revision bomb you in structure manager So see this, we have created this refill assembly separately. Now it get automatically updated here. You can, okay. Now you want to expand, okay, this three uh, sub assemblies. So you need to go in a view and you click on expand below or expand below dot dot. When you select this it get expanded from here also you can do this you want to call back collapse below you can click on that it get collapse if you want to expand it get expand also from here expand below dot dot okay how much level okay see here are the levels because in big assembly structure there are number of levels five levels six levels so still what level you want to call out this so by using this you can uh, use this expand dot dot expand below dot dot suppose we want to expand up to one level then we click on that what we will do uh, we do collapse then we go for expand below dot dot it is for one level okay so see here level for one level it get expanded now these are the bomb columns okay you can you can manage these bomb columns so for this you need to select right click on this bar 
and from here insert or remove column you can manage this okay suppose you don't want this you can remove you don't want this you can remove this okay suppose anything you want here assign occurrence you can add also you can rearrange the structure then again for particular project you need to you want this selected bomb columns now so you can save this here from name description for that user or for group or for whole site you can save that particular bomb columns you require for particular project from here so by clicking apply cancel you will get this required bomb columns again one thing suppose you select this tip or you want to suppose this tip has some attachment or some jt files or you want to see this so for that you need to click on that show hide panel okay and here you will get whatever the attachment this item revision have okay here also different uh, options variant graphics references so you can use this again suppose you want to uh, hide this information you again uh, click on that it get hide you want this structure manager as a whole window so from here navigation pane you can get this okay so this is the way to create the structure of any product in a structure manager